gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, today we've been called by a customer that has a uh, one-ton pickup pulling a flatbed trailer loaded with a piece of equipment that apparently, I don't know if the truck rolled or if the trailer came loose. Uh, the gentleman was uh, a little bit upset, obviously, uh, but apparently the trailer, at least the trailer and the piece of equipment are down about 100 foot rolled uh, down an embankment off the road. I don't know about the truck, but uh, they said there were no injuries, which is always a great thing. Uh, I'm headed up. They did request that we bring the big truck. Uh, Mike's behind me in a rollback, and we'll see what else, if anything, we need once we get on scene. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are here. Eh, it's not that far down. But it does have, the trailer does have a piece of equipment on it. We'll have to see what we want to do, what they want us to do. Work with them and see what we got. Well, I was looking at the gate there, but I don't know if you could get through it. Nah. I don't, even worth it. I don't know, we'll see. Let me uh, spray my legs down so I don't get chiggerfied and I'll run down there and see. Want some of this? Woo, you had a little bit, didn't you? Oh, yeah, you betcha I did. Okay, the machine has shifted. Oh, it's leaking. I kind of stayed no, back with mine, so we uh, had the air yeah, board. There's, uh, we got something leaking. It smells like gas. I can't tell if it is it gas. Well, there's hydraulic oil leaking here. Okay. Hello. Well, I'm not quite sure yet. We've got. Uh, I mean, I can handle it with the rotator, but we got uh, uh, a one ton with a uh, tandem axle uh, tilt deck and a Sunbelt Sunbelt Reynolds uh, boom lift. The boom lift's pretty bad shape and it's shifted. The rear of it's come off the off the trailer. The trailer's on its side and it's jackknifed into the truck. The basket of the basket is caught in the bed of the truck, actually. Well, the boom lift may have to come off, yeah, and, and be handled separately. That's what I'm considering. Right now, we may have to get the truck straightened out first. I'm a, I got to walk around here and see if we can straighten the truck out. It's got the back end of the truck lifted in the air. The tongue of the trailer is holding the truck up. Yeah, if you want to come, that's fine. Probably the, uh, oh, the other rollback would be my guess. Oh, the, okay, the, uh, yeah, because it's got my cutters in it. We're going to have to cut the safety chains, I think, on this trailer. Oh, wow, it's got a lot of tension on it. All right, I'm going to let you go. Yeah, that chain right there is it. And it's caught on this edge right here, too. I don't know that basket. 
what's going to happen whenever it. Mm -hmm. We don't want to be close to it though. No, not when. It... Give me a couple of blocks, Mike, please, for the front and the back. Yeah. Ground's probably soft enough, but we're at an angle, so I'm going to have to build it up. Just enough to, yeah, probably one more on top of that crossways, please. Winch free spool. Oh, yes, please. Unlock the carry. We're good on the back, Mike. Yeah, we're good on the back. One of the big tall ones on the on the front up here, if you can get it. Yeah. Nope. We're not going to need much for no more weight. All right, we need something strong to grab a hold of on the front of that. And the tow hooks on those Fords are not strong. Remember the utility truck that they ripped the front bumper off of? What? We need something strong on the front, and the tow hooks on those Fords aren't the best. Okay. Because uh, they, uh, remember the utility truck that ripped the front bumper and tow hooks and everything off of it? No, you don't. You don't know about that story. Okay, never mind. I won't tell you that story until later. <laughs> we didn't do it. They called us after they did it. Oh, okay. We can try it, but we'll stop way before we tear it off. Okay. Uh, I guess just get some straps, a couple of red straps or something. Good one. Should be the eights right there. What? That should be the eights right there. Yep, two of those.
I can't hardly see. Yeah, it's, it's hard to see that in the light. Take the uh, this red one off. Take this red one off the hook. Plus twist. Yep. That's better. Oh, we need those chains undone. I wonder now I if I let it down, down it may relieve enough pressure. Oh, nope. The dish? Mitch. Mitch. Well, we're gonna have to cut the chains, but the chains are under tension. No, the yeah, I know there's gas out of this. I smell that. We're gonna have to cut those safety chains though, or Bolt cutters, maybe, maybe. You can stand on the rock down here and see it, but. Well, there's vertebra of something right here. Some kind of critter. Yeah. Tail, yep, right there. Oh, there's all kind of bones down here. Oh, well, there is, there. Uh, yeah. That would be maybe a dog. I don't know. Uh, yeah, well, I've got it hooked up, but watch yourself because that safety chain is the only thing holding it. We got it free from the basket. Ooh, man, that's a nice new rice trailer. Uh, yeah, it was. The one chain is loose, ain't it? Yeah, this one's good. I don't know if we could, not, well, we could maybe pop that pin, but somebody's gonna have to be down here in the way. And then you're gonna be. Well, wait a minute, let's get one while we got a chance. Huh? We've already taken what we could loose. Might go get a, a pair of side cutters. We might take a hammer and pop that and get enough loose, but it's gonna have to be out of the way. I'll get up preferably. Mike? Yep. Ah. Hold on, Dad. Hey. I was gonna get a bar to do that, but. Do what? It'll come down and I'll see if I can let I'll it tell loose. You what, I wonder. This is kind of complicated, but yeah. we run a cable under this truck and up to here. Pull it down. Yeah. Pull it down and up. What we might be able to do is pull the back of the truck that way. What I was going to say is if we could knock that you won't, I don't, and well, drive that it. drive that pin out. I got my doubts it didn't come out tight as it is. Well, I do too, but save that. I've got the truck, but save watch. That. I put it up over here. I've there got you go. I, I, a little well, before you start beating on it, Mike, watch that trailer so that some of the gun don't stand on this side. I've got the truck. Okay. You need a punch or something to finish driving it through. Ain't nothing up here, bud. 
Yeah, shoot. Where's the other pin? Well, that ain't, that won't work. That won't work because it'll get locked in. Here, Mike, Mike. Side cutters on the head of the. Yep. That was what my thoughts were too. Let's get a cable on that mic up here somewhere just to so it don't just go. So it don't knock go down. And then here, go up and get the right stuff to dry that yeah, with. You're dying. Yeah, we don't want that. Next block, right there. Into the master link. Up, other side, up, turn it up. Well, on that it ain't gonna matter because it's gonna turn sideways, so. We can probably reverse roll it though. Need a chain, Bubba. Yep. Just get the frame one, the frame chain. The frame grab chain. Around the other way. Around the other way. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Here. So I'm looping this. Yep. Just loop it. And let me get some tension on it. That's all we gotta do. Alright, everybody clear? It might even, like Dad said, it might even pull down on it. Nope. How about pull your truck? No, it's stretching it more. Okay, I've got the truck. Let me back off of it a little bit. All right, I've got it. Go ahead and knock that pin out if you can. Watch yourself now. There we go, got it. Coolness. All right, let off on the trailer so the chain comes out. Get the truck out of the way. Very big knot down. Does it? <laughs> yeah, they've got frame on it. Oh, yeah. Uh, 
uh, if you would, Mike, go ahead and unhook me there because I'm going to have to stretch the boom out. Yes, please. Yeah, I see it. Watch yourself, don't get near that tire. I may have to reset, Mike, but I'm gonna bring it up here to where we can get it on one of these rollbacks. Front ways, back ways, it don't really, I don't guess it really matters. Bumper pull trailers is what they're good for. Yeah. I was just gonna get it up here on the well, close just, to the shoulder. Well, I was just thinking about the back Well, I mean, he can load it from the front, the back, it does not matter. Uh, I'm just getting it up here close to the road. Hey, Dad, I can grab a hold of the... Before we start this, this side's going to fall off. There's another chain. Yeah. You better get that chain. Okay, that yep. Bumper. Yep, got it. Just going to have to give me a minute. I got chains and boomers here. Oh, okay. You all right?
there? I can catch it. No. With the... Oh. Is that... Do I need to come down with that? Bummer. Not exactly where I want to be with it. Nothing better than... Nothing. Wrong way. We need to do the same on the front too because they did the same thing. They just went straight through. It's hanging on the fender. Huh? It's hanging on the fender. On the front. Tired resting on the fender. Okay. That's the shop. Yo. Okay. All right. Bye. All right. So we set up here like we want to be. Well, I'd like to be under the machine more with both of them. Not quite sure how to accomplish that back here, though, unless we uh, route it underneath the tire. Or under the axle, yeah, about, that's about the only way to do it, ain't it? Get it back behind here. It ain't gonna go under that though, which is really what I wanted. Yeah, hold on, I mean, that ain't really where I want it either. And get on the other side. There's my pusher pole. I can grab it up high and uh, control it going down. Can you see it there? All right, go ahead, if you can. Keep it going. It ain't gonna come up under there, is it? No, it'll come up under the boom. I just gotta do what you gotta do to put the shot. Right now, it's all we got left. Yep. One on each. Oh, 
Uh, lay that red one down there, please. That'll be our catch. Yes. Huh? Yes. Figure we'll go over the frame and run a red strap. Wrap that around. What are you gonna do? Uh, just take the did chain. You have a big chain? <laughs> yeah, I got a big chain. I can get a smaller one. I'm just gonna say go around the spring or the axle with the chain, and then uh, the strap will go on the other side. Right, them weeds, them weeds are stronger than the chain. Because you don't want the strap on any of the sharp edges. There you go. man's trailer. I don't think it's going to hurt. Oh, yeah, that's all we got to have. Just so the chain will come over. And... Hey, uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, it was, what, 50 degrees this yeah, morning? It nice. Now it's almost 90. Oh, Mike, we're not hooked into the strap with the with the cable. Red cable needs to go into the red strap, please. That'll work a little better. That'll also help me scoot it away from those rocks. I hope. It's hung on that chain pocket. I'll get it, I'll get it. Can you see me up there? Yeah, go ahead, Mike. That way I can control the... Just lift it up over the chain pocket. There we go. Nope, I got you. I got you, brother. What? Let me tell you, too. I'm gonna try to get it scooted away from those rocks a little bit first if we can. That's rough. I see an issue with that. Maybe not. Just give me a minute. Get 
Let me walk her out of there. Do what? And it looks like a new lift is going to be in order on this one. It's bringing some rocks with us. straps are about where I want you. Can you move my truck? I'm going to end up moving it moves anyway. Yeah. You can get all that on that figure up real bad. I don't know. We've already lost the machine off the... Well, this one has to be reposition once it gets set up. Yeah. I've kept the uh, angles low. Is that uh, bucket pinned or not? Because it was wanting to swivel. Uh, is that your bucket pinned? I don't know. Looks like a manual jack handle to me. Well, they come out here somewhere. Truck, maybe? No. Okay. Mikey, get us a ratchet strap, please. Let's throw over that boom. Okay. D ring work better. I got this if you want to snug her down, Mikey. Oh, you got a lot of slack. You're going to have to back her out. There you go. That's right. It went from your side pocket to the... Got it. Here. Main thing is to keep that bucket from shifting on us. Playing around. Yep. That started spinning whenever we rolled it. All right. Now, I can probably scoot it up. A little bit more but we're gonna run out of our straps are too long gonna be too long here real quick actually let's go ahead and take the straps out and let's just go straight you'll know, hook it up and drag it out you think think it'll stay upright that way yeah 
it's sitting right here yeah i think it'll work i may i'll probably have to uh move forward again to get it spun around but we can do it yeah let's well the more we pull it sideways the more it's going to build up this dirt and it's getting pretty bad yep skid steer skid steer would be nice Give me my glove back. Do what, buddy? Oh, uh, just tell you what you step behind you. you. All right. Hold on. Mike, take that uh, snatch block out of there, please. Just leave the snatch block on it, just take it loose. There you go. Don't want to do what I did last time. Try to learn from your mistakes. <laughs> Stretch on out there, girl. I'm just gonna keep that red one on there to keep it from rolling and running away. Okay. White and red. Auxiliary and the main together. Get it up here a little more, don't think. I was hoping to pivot it around, but it not wanting to pivot. Taking it in the back end. 
Yep. That don't help, does it? Well, now that just brings back in around, which isn't what I want. If you're wanting it this way, I was thinking tongue out, and then you can put the, everything up on the rollback, maybe. What do you think, trailer and all? Well, the way I'm doing it, it's going to do that. Well, if it comes on out of there, I don't know what's going out for uh, They've given us the whole lane here, so I can boom out more, even. I think she'll come right on up out of here. Tink. No, I'm not done yet. Yeah, they do. get out of it. It's not what I wanted. We're out of cable. I'm out on the auxiliary winch. I'm either going to have to pull forward and reposition or uh, do what you suggested and uh, redirect off the front of the little Pete and pull it forward. I'm sure I'd see it roll back down that ditch. Uh huh. Well, I've got it held right now. I know. I'd say get, get that little Pete up here and we'll just redirect. Oh, step ladder, Mike. Maybe, please, sir.
probably should have went to that side. It's all right. That's all right. All right, guys. Watch out, please. do is this uh, other winch will swing the back end over see it should help pull it up on there watch that tire Mike watch that tire I just let off of it. There we go. I can't believe it's pulling both of those. We hauled him on the rollback. Yeah, I know it. <laughs> yeah, get get your block. It's wanting to stay up. 
the front is. Looks like the machine shifted back some. Yep, that's what I thought. The machine shifted back. So all the, the weight's kicking the nose up. Yep. Let's get another block. I've got wheel chalk in front of this one, but let's get another block so it don't roll forward anymore into that. Yeah, it should. What? Yeah, I know. I was trying to get directly over it first. Thing really needs to be forward on the trailer, don't it? Let's get this. Let me get this tied down somewhere. Well, there's D rings right here, too. That way. Take yours up a little more so we don't get tangled. You've watched enough of these, you ready to work them? Well, I just bought a tractor, or I'm gonna buy a tractor, and I need to know how all those things there work before I fucking go. Oh, how the time down? Yeah, because I don't want to use the normal, like, right. right down straps. Well, ideally, you don't want to run them straight through like that. Right. You want to run one to each side, or one, to, one chain to each ring. That's what allowed this thing to shift mm -hmm. side to side. No matter how tight you got a little play in Yep. We're going to load it on the okay. rollback. Yeah, we're, we're going to secure this. Then we're going to pick the rear of the trailer up, swing it over on the road so we can line it up with the rollback and we'll load the whole thing up on the rollback. That's our plan anyway. He's trying to get the machine. We got the machine squared on the trailer. All right, Mikey, watch yourself. Going up. Take that block and put it on the front tire. This one ain't near as bad as that pipe, flow to pipe. No, it, this machine doesn't hold much.
Now we did find some forensic evidence. There's some bones down there. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna try to get his own care. Good enough? Let's call Detective out. All right, block your wheels, Mike. Yep. Go the axle. I guess we can go to the chain pocket, so whatever. pocket that way it doesn't ride towards the center It's loose. Hold on. Whoa. <laughs> That'll work. Not exactly what I had planned, but it'll work. Do what? Block it off though so I can straight once it gets straight. Or do we just keep dragging it up that way? We need to take this rail off. block it off and I can get my winch straight on it. Well, put, no, put all the chalks under each of the wheels. And let's see what happens. I got this. Go the other side, go the other side. Block 
Yeah, I put, no, I think that's, we'd probably better stop there, don't you think? Tire down. Let's tie it down before I lift it up. I just now put the airbags back up. I had them down. That helps when you load it. You feel good with that or you want more on it? Okay. Alright, those cones go on here. comfortable with it. Let's roll out. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, there she was. We got her before sundown. Before sunset, anyway. best case scenario as far as uh, people and injuries go uh, could have been much 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 worse as always thank you for watching and God bless